Welcome back guys to Hyrule Warriors Age of Calamity where last episode with trophies obtained so that we can finish up the quest on the map we soon started our next story mission Eren Lightning as with Abosa and Rivali battling against the Blights invading their guardians they were backed up by Riju and Teva as Link and Co hit the battlefield. Our first target was Varnaboris and Thunderblight Ganon, rescuing a boss before Riju and his Sandsil Patricia surfed onto the scene, as we then used an upgust to reach Varmeadow in the sky, rescuing Ravali, the final of our four champions under threat. With Ravali and Tabor then taking their Divine Beast out to clear the remaining forces, and having witnessed Astor sacrificing the Yiga for Calamity Ganon, we now start another questing period. Alright, that seems to be all the hand in quests done for now. So now it's up for us to take on our trials. It really wants me to go do Reju's training first, but I think I should go do Tebas so I can get the other quest done. In the meantime, we've got to remove seals. So, Reju definitely got some weaponry. Special attack damage. So it's a standard Grudu Bridle. Can't get it up to level 5 by the look of it. Mm -hmm. I will spend some money just to power up one bridle. Oh, I could have got it to level 5. I just managed to... I just remembered to take that blooming quest. I just, I just took it off. <laughs> I equipped it with the good one. That's what I should do first. Like, if I go here, I can click on you and see if there was another bow that you... Didn't get another bow at all. I guess it's because Riju actually got to play for the tiniest period of time. Could have got it leveled up. You. It's much easier with the other guys, though. You already have a certain amount of level up. Right, so we can go to there today. That doesn't go to level five. <laughs> that was complete waste of money. I shouldn't have done it. He still went ahead and did it. <laughs> uh, let's go to here. Ooh. Spend a little money. Just bringing everyone up to a base level of 45. I think I've still got good money left, and by the time we complete the next few missions, we'll have probably got most of that money back. So everyone's at level 45 now, apart from Zelda and Link. Link needs to be tough for his missions after all. 43 is the recommended level for this over here. Right then! Let's do Teba's challenge. Let's learn how to Tiba. Teba. Let's learn how to fight. Let's do this. So you've just got the one set of ground moves with your extra, extra strong arrow, which I don't know if we can charge that up in the middle of a combo to do a different thing or not. We'll have to, we'll have to trial that. Or if it is just the X combos. And it seems that when we're doing a strong attack, we just need to press X a lot. Targeting enemies isn't too hard. Those are the only two instructionals for Teba. 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 Teba's way easier to say. Teba. Look at this conga line going on below me. It's getting a bit bloated. Hey, it's a Warriors game. Who'd have guessed? What the floor, that was interesting, okay. I do have a time limit. So I can hold it up and power up into an attack. So it seems that the actual arrow shot is no matter what the same. But maybe it changes depending on certain other facets, I don't know. I said, where did all my arrows go? And then they come back here. <laughs> oh, I actually get to fire. <laughs> right then. Let's use this. That did the trick. Just aerially bombarded the place. Oh, what? Some guy got me from behind. Look at him! Look at him go! Oh, 
Did I charge that up enough that I got a bum arrow on it? I'm assuming all these bombs coming from above are me. <laughs> well, um, carpet bombs much. And I've still got stuff falling everywhere from what we did in the past, but look at it! <gasps> what? Oh wow, that's even cooler for hitting that attack. All I have to do is walk into him. Wow, nice fire, King. Cool. I never got to find out what was in his boxes, if there was a cork anywhere. I just, uh, put a little everything to smithereens. <laughs> That's Swan Oboe. This bow is a favourite among retail warriors. The post string has been specially engineered for aerial combat, which now to be drawn faster than a normal bow, does it now? Even got some weapons for you and the materials we need for the other quest. Tabers known as the destroyer of frames? I mean, her boast is the original. <laughs> when she says stuff along the lines of you don't deserve any mercy and stuff, it's about the frames. It's not about the enemies on the pitch. I mean, the enemies contribute to that frames. It's so weird, though, with games. I, I don't care. Like, I, I keep seeing people on forums and this and that going like, ah! The frames, where the frames, and they cry about like games when there's flame drops and stuff. But I'm just always there, like, it's not like the most important thing ever. Goodness gracious, gameplay, yeah. I mean, it'd be great if the frames didn't drop, but I'm not gonna cry about it. Oh, whole bed. We have the stuff we needed, and I didn't even read the I thing. Yet reached my peak. The children were so enraptured seeing the warriors train up close, they hardly touched their packed lunches. So we got packed lunches from see the warriors doing. The field trip inspired them to think about how to keep Hyrule safe. Another special gauge for Tema. <laughs> and then flight training at Lake Totori. Rita warriors used to practice gliding at Lake Totori, but recently they had to cancel these sessions due to a lack of supplies. Pitch them with some resources so they can resume training. 1,500 rupees! I mean, I do like bonus combos. Is that Looking on the Y? good, huh? The Rita Warriors had enough supplies to begin training once more, watching them dart with ease through the sky above Lake Tatori. Tiba was inspired to emulate their techniques. That's actual X combo. Alright, it's also the winged X caught, which is a locked in encounter for you, is it? And that bow is slightly worse, but at least has some, you know, stats to it. So I'll put that one on, because it at least has a bonus. And I guess if you're going there, you can go there on your own. Onward, they say. For more Tabor action. One of Tabor's combos can mess with the cameras more. I'm sure many attacks can mess with cameras in this game. I'm pretty sure I've seen multiple things go weird and odd. It's just too much going on in a game like this. At times. But, eh. I mean, as long as it doesn't crash me. <laughs> I'm fine, right? Game's got it safe. It's all good. Right? Crashes during all safe. Yeah! Yeah, I am escorting you. And Rivali's coming too. That's very careful. We wouldn't like guests to be injured, would we? Oh, 
what? I've got to actually aim it? Oh, no. I'm trying to hit this guy so I can break him. Also, where's my guy I'm escorting on? Probably a bit of a worry for me, I guess. I forgot that he existed. Oh, God, he's fighting Frost Talus! Good luck with that. I'll help. I don't know where the other Moblin's got to, though. Keep firing! Just critical hits all the time. It's great. Only in Captain, stop getting hit. I don't seem to be doing a good job anymore. I thought you just said my keys. I think your keys are the issue. I can't see anything! I've gone off in a weird direction! I seem to have not hit him in time. No clue what's going on most of the time, Tabor. I gotta admit. Maybe I should just kill it. That did the trick. Can't be bombed. Could have gone worse. I mean, it could have gone worse, yeah, but it went fine. So let's not focus on the negative here, guys. In the meantime, what's up here? Korok. Did look redundantly out of place. So he's gone on to fight what now? I've got my specials back because I leveled up by the look of it. Let's just make sure we leave no bigger monster left. Works for me. They're blitz. It's always nice to kill one of them. They don't tend to have a lot of HP. Saying that, they lived. Now what are you fighting? <laughs> Camera angles! Tabor, you're a bit too fast when you're attacking. Everything just happens. So what we've got is we seem to have got two incredibly fast characters. So is this bridge going to collapse? Not with me on it, that's for sure. Where am I? Where have I gone? Listen to it. Was the stasis bow? I don't even know anymore. What am I even doing to myself? What the? Fine, I'm going places. No, stop this! Stop flying around really fast. Just wait for this guy to break so you can kill him. <laughs> what the hell? 
are you doing, man? Ah! The frame's gone! <laughs> Stand still when I'm doing that, that'd be better. I think they're dead. Good job, I got them both. <laughs> I feel like I might not have had good- We've been getting a lot of new characters lately. I'm trying to get my head around like what each character does. It's a bit of a nightmare in and of itself. For when you find you like the most, yeah, yeah, because he's just stands his ground. It's a very simple playstyle. You just press a one button prompt when you're doing a strong attack. Not too hard to understand what to do with that one, is it? Sidon makes a lot of sense. Oh look, a Korok. In a side mission again. That's the second one. There's one in Mephus training too, but... Yeah, we got it. Just wish there. Uh, tell me beforehand. This is why you find it hard to fight with Tebe. It seems like if you maybe do the combos and don't press a direction, then at least you'll stay in a space. Oh, hello. I mean, Captain, how about you not fight this? Just leave this to me, I'm dying. That did the trick. Bad. It's because I'm holding the drink button down. Oh, what? You reached. I mean, this, this, well, no, I'll definitely hit for that. I just need to find the best combo to do with him, really. Ow. Oh, the flurry rushes can be painful. Rally. Don't just tank it to the face, man. Yeah, that one seems pretty good for breaking. Just a single Y to X. Oh no, I did two Ys. Fine, we'll just do this. He's very good at hitting these though. Those props work really well. Yeah, that's really good for breaking. Coming. Cool. This is amazing. He's really good versus the little. Uh oh, I pressed the wrong button. Yeah, I missed it.
He's so good against that. Oh, just the way his bomb and his Cryonis works, it's just so perfect against them. So good. That's good. Marvel. So that's the 35th month. Thank you very much. Twitch Tribe. Alright, so now you have to level 47. You got a new bow, Falcon Bow. Battlefield specific material drop rate at 9%. That's stronger than his current bow. Ancient part drop rate for Rivali. And one more ethereal stone. We've gathered so many of them, but now we seem to be spending loads. I mean, his magnesis was pretty good, yes. Seeming you just literally got to choose to target and activate. And that it will seem to freeze time while you're doing it. So you don't have to worry about placement. Because that's what I think Deluxe... For well, certain characters, stuff like Cryonis' versus Linnell's just straight up misses. Unless you're like, f have a distance and you're far away, you can't do it in a snap action. Because it like, summons out somewhere weird. Meanwhile, Teba wants to have all the quests and no one else is allowed to have another quest. Actually, the quest is for Link, the so-called knight. Where he has to face Rivali, Sidon, Mifa, and more. What? Molly is skeptical of Link, whereas Sidon has never doubted the swordsman's abilities. Link has unfortunately been dragged into the dispute. Oh, really? This sounds like a more interesting one, doesn't it? Also, we've got this quest up here, which is any ice training, so that can be done by anyone. More Linnels there. A big Hinox, too. Link, you've been dragged into the dispute. What weapon should we use? Have we got a really strong two-hander or a really strong spear? Could go try and use the Royal Guard's Claymore for a bit. Rare material drop right up. Why not? Let's go two-handed Link versus them. A little bit different. Beat Rivali with a mop. <laughs> Okay, we're not going quite there, but I'm actually going to use something different for once for Link. Of course, the Master Sword. You can't use the Master Sword, right? You've, you, you've got to. But still. I understand the two-handed Link a little bit more now. You just basically use the, uh, the ZR button to do spinny-type moves as part of combos, which take up HP, which you then restore by doing the X button, which is normally where he was cut bashing his tummy for me, but they replaced the temporary hearts lost by the attacks. That's basically two-handed link. Two-handed whomping link, not two-handed spear link. Over here. I will show you what I'm made of. And you go, and you go. And you go, nom 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 nom. I should probably kill you. Eat all the food. Oh wait, I have time limit. Of course I have a time limit. I need to go that way, okay. Excuse me, I need to go this way. The time limit's only for capturing the two outposts, which should be able to be done really fast, to be fair. So I'm gonna go check out what's over here first. I do like rupees. Doesn't seem to be anything more than that, though, does it? Do -do 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 -do. Oh, you get! I'm taking away my temp hearts. Mipha's here! Oh, that makes capturing the outpost a bit harder. For a time limit, whoops. Alright, 
Mies is nearly down off that one attack. As a level up, that's level 50. Got another Royal Guards Claymore in the spots. That's not all I've got. If I gave you all I got, you wouldn't like it quite a lot. Camps the outpost occupied by the Rito soldiers now, so nothing's down here. 2 minutes 49. Let's get motoring. You can end up with some quite cool attacks from the uh, the combo and with the ever extra bits, so that's kind of cool. I've gone past it! <laughs> I was too busy going spinning around then. Link, nom nom. Better hurry up. Oh man, you got to the other side of me? That's not good. I missed him. I didn't mean to miss him. Right, you're in my base, but you don't matter, so let's go, go, go. Is there anything up this pathway? Apart from the fact that you're Bowman, you have no HP whatsoever. Seemingly not. 1 minute 27. I should have the time right. Tabor and the allies have appeared. Ow! I didn't even mean to press that. Don't stop doing things I don't mean to press. Maybe I should have gone with a master sword and not treated them so lightly. Alright, Dave up. So where am I going next? The outposts have indeed been captured. So Ravali's coming to take me down himself, is he? Fantastic. I knew we'd do a link. Now let us settle this. I'm trying my best. So they're both up there, are they? I'm going over here because this looked like the most suspicious bit of ground. But turns out not to be. I should have gone the other way because that's where the specials will be. So who am I attacking? Fantastic. Simming you, Rivali. <laughs> no. Oh, my God, they're taking me out. That's Ravali, who got taken out in the blink of an eye. Help, please. Stop being mean to me, Sido. Aren't we pals? I think we're 
I've got him now. Bye, Zedo. I didn't find a cover up. And I beat everyone up. You went down before Zedon did. That makes you miss. I love how Zedon's just like so happy. That I clocked them good. So called knight. Don't I have apples? Yeah, I do, but I don't want to use the apples in my supply. <laughs> I want to use the apples on the field. I want free apples. Hey, a Guardian Sword Plus Plus! The ability of this Guardian Sword has been boosted to the maximum. It's evidenced by its increase in size. It slices through armor like a hot knife through butter. That's a... No, is that two-hander? I can't carry any more weapons. City Link getting weapons handy at you. I quite like the look of the Grudu Claymore, but bye bye, you haven't got any skills or abilities on you. I mean, technically, I only need to get rid of two. Ah, oh, little spear as well! Guess I should make you into something. Right, we gotta make your shakalaka maracas in time. We get the rubber armor! This precious armor covers the wearer in a rare special material called rubber! Such technology does not exist in this modern age. The modern age that really desperately needs it. But we just eat flowers and then we're fine from the lightning. Okay, sorry. I forgot. Enlightened. I mean, to be honest, when you put when you eat the flowers and the herbs and you, you become lightning resistant, you don't have to look like a ridiculous rubber fish man. So I guess, you know, each of their own. 48% completion rate. We're about to get to 50%. It's happening. Ooh. Right, Link. Oh, I didn't actually have to sell two weapons. Whoops. Alright, so that is a one-hander, of course. Sword and shield at actual marker right next to it. It says exactly that. What's the weapon that looks the coolest? I've got lots of these level one ones. That I need to fuse into something to make something better. I should have kept the little spear now I look at it. I mean, we got the wooden mop power. <laughs> it's level six. Well, that was my uh, best one handed broadsword, interestingly enough. Reduce damage from ice and damage per 100% KOs. It's not too bad. I guess we can always feed the master sword further. So I need to feed you these claymores and that does have an ability does level 15 get you a new something wow it seems that not with anything that I have here can I get to level 15 so that's got some extra damage to it no so level 15 doesn't actually create a new thing kind of sad I would like to just get there. Costs 1,200 rupees to fuse up to level 15, though, at this rate. Yikes. I think I'll just fuse to 14, then. For now. <laughs> At least take some of the weapons off my list, right? Oh, I could have put the Dragon Bone Mobbling Club into something as well. Let's just fuse that into that. I mean, that's 150 per fuse, whereas that's 70 per fuse. That's 70 per fuse as well. Go that way. Fuse up some of the level ones into it. Make a little bit more space. <laughs> Cost another 300 rupees. Everyone else's weapons are actually being keeping kept rather in check. Oh, except for Ravali's, which is completely just expanded. 
by a large bit. Let's use the ancient drop part rate one then and just bang it in with... Oh, no, 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 no. Not that one. Bang it in with some... Oh, you even have to consider this stuff, though. Ancient part drop rate. This one. Then these ones, because that will be a fusion. Ha. Huh. 10% ain't too bad. Got a little bit of a bonus there for level 7. Bring down some of his spacing a little bit. I don't think I actually have any effects that really join together here. Should have done with the monster part drop right, actually. That would have made way more sense. Six there. Okay, looking good. Oh, I really need you to actually have a thing that fusions. Oh yeah, we've got the Shakalaka Maracas. Tank speed six percent. What if I combine it with that? Only level four. What's this got? A special attack damage. I want to build these up then. Let's just use one. So that's 50 damage. Ideally, you want something that goes like that. So let's fuse these to make it a much stronger weapon. These are going to be the attack speed maracas of choice. So he's got these for monster part drop rate, and then he's got this for like ultimate attack speed. We're gonna want to change his weapon in the future, I'm sure. Anyone else's weapons getting a bit too full? Like, Teba could actually go for a proper fusion. Looks like he'd be a drop rate weapon though if I did that. That's only if I get to level 5, which I can't, so it's useless to do. So many weapons to care about at all times. <laughs> right, let's continue clearing up our side missions, shall we? You want me to go to escorting the injured next, but we've got to do redo stuff, don't you know? This is how things work. One at a time. So you have the bridal of the seven. Let's go and find out what kind of power she can wield as we try to... Nailed to soon someone else's crazy combat. Oi, oi, oi. This episode has been Teba and Ritu Training. <laughs> Maybe that'll be the title. I've kind of avoided putting that in the titles thus far, though, because spoilers. But equally, it's been more than a month since release now. <laughs> I didn't put it in the title for the other thing. It's just water and fire. I didn't even put what happens in the title. I didn't sp <laughs> But there's a certain point where you move forward and that's what the theme of the episodes are. Let's say, what did your one work like? I'm well, supposed to gather up enemies with you and then attack them otherwise. Seems kind of weird to me. Anything here? No. Can I be certain that Patricia will keep them front and centre? Well, that worked. Flying around. Come on, I'm gonna do something good. Do something I can abuse. That's what I really want you to do. I missed. Can I do the thing? I'm 
I don't even know what's going on. But I now know that Fire Breath and Zalfos have appeared, so I'm guessing that's a good thing. Progress, right? I mean, I could just electrocute them all. That yeah, works. Speaking of electric, where is it? It's just the next group, is it? Help! I don't think I'm the one in actual control. What the hell? Patricia can fly? Work? Does that gather everyone into their utter deaths? Seems to work quite well, yeah. Good work, Patricia. Oh, Patricia, watch out! Help! I'm out of control! Stand still. There we go. Help! Yeah, it honestly feels like I have no actual control over the character whatsoever. Like, I'm not deciding what to do. The character is just deciding to do things. Patricia, nothing's going bad at the moment. We're staying relatively in the same location by me not pressing any directions. What are we doing, Patricia? I don't know. But we won. I guess that's all that matters, right? Patricia, slow down! <laughs> Level 46 from Riju. And some more goodies. But not to the level of bridal that we have. A damage of full hearts plus 4%. Fishing harpoon for Sidon. What's he gonna do? Fish himself? And we'll see if that opens up any more trials and challenges as well. There's quite a few being put on the board by this. Are we at 50% completion yet? That's what I'm wondering. I do wonder what's wa weighted heaviest. The normal little quests, are they all weighted the same? Or are the, the trials weighted a little bit more? Are the Korok seeds part of the completion percentage? I don't think they are. See, I collected a bunch more and I didn't really think that it moved anywhere or changed. Well, it's some more stuff. You want me to do this, do you? The chief in training? Well, I can't do this by the look of it, because I'm missing hydro melons. Which are gained from that quest. Yes, I get that. Also, this stable. Basak. Beautiful. Basak. Ah. I would like all your hydro melons. <laughs> Power up the future. Sand seals from the sand seal rental shop are going away. Hey, whoa! It seems they're banning renters to go after alluring fruits near Grudu Town. Time to fight fruit with fruit. We're just going to lure them back. Another combo for Riju. Not like I could tell what combo I was doing. Now they were receiving fresh fruity compensation for the hard work, the sand seals stopped running away. That ought to give the Grudu some much needed peace of mind. Another strong attack on the combo, sure. Right, our next quest the chief in training. Let's go. Just ever so nicely set a couple of levels above the recommended level. That's how I like it. Doesn't give you too much extra strength, but 
Strength that's appreciated nonetheless. When you don't know what you're doing, it's more difficult to control her, but it's be you'll be something to behold. Yes, it's just not difficult. It's not easy to control her no matter what. <laughs> that's the only tip you get for a Riju, by the way. Just go mental. Oh, okay. Seems she's the fat. Is, is she the fastest, nippiest character? Probably. That's what small characters often end up being, after all. Big, hefty characters, slow. Small characters, super fast. You'd think that leg span Indeed. would mess with it a bit. Seems I can do this combo until the end of time. And all that only killed 12 guys. Ow. To a higher number now, at least. Oh, I've got Wu now. Oh, she's got a fast stasis. That's pretty good. Wait, am I just being flung around? Doesn't seem like the good best way for me to be attacking. Well, one big upwards kick at the end of it all. It's just me floating around her. <laughs> it's fine. Suga! be the future chief and all, so I guess I better destroy the lackey of the other one. Ah! Ah! Oh, no. That will be... You getting any allies anytime soon, Suga? You gave up? Well, Suga's out. Eager Blade Masters have appeared. I'm starting to wonder if your special actually even kills people. Let's take this guy over here. Yeah, she's blooming fast. Need to defeat X amount of Yiga Clan as well. Fine, we'll just get a different way every time to just roast some poor friends. I mean, enemies. I'm going up this wall. Whether I mean to or not. Man, you can't both come out at the same time. Oh, that's pretty. Do that, though. Should be kicked off into oblivion that way. Ow! I'm on a shield! We We just chose to kick some poor other Yiga guy in the face? Seems a bit mean.
weren't originally going for that guy, but all of a sudden turned around and went, yeah, we'll kill you. Very much like my special to rebuild at the moment. I mean, 300 KOs and free Giga Blade Masters more. Let me ride all over you, you'll be fine. Honest. Some rupees. Where is the mainstay of my enemies left now? I'll just fly on them in the air. What the hell? I imagine there are a certain amount of these Yiga getting beaten up here, but you wonder what they did to deserve this. Yeah, you say half the time it remains. It's not like I've got multiple big pockets of Yiga clan guys to deal with. So am I supposed to have been fighting the other guys for a bit longer, maybe? Now I have to wait for a certain time limit for more to appear. You guys okay? I just just electrocuted. I very much expect the answer to be no. Riding through the desert, electrocuting all the people. It's interesting to find in this desert the heat, lack of water, not a problem. Not the real problem anyway. Greatest source of death, electricity. I think I'm actually going to kill all the eager of the desert at this rate, this is good. Finding the remaining ones is a bit of a problem. Hi. Is anyone alive? Right, six more you're gonna find. Oh, there's a there's a blip on the map. It's over here. That's enough. Alright, so 400. Now I've only got two minutes left to kill Suga. That's a lot of guys! Two of the blade masters down. Two is down to half HP. What? I seem to have knocked him out of the attack.
Oh, I can charge with Cryonis. So you're still alive. I don't have a time anymore, well, okay. I don't know how you expect to get her, to be honest. Suga never released a bunch of a chance, did he? Well, that's three more wipe bananas. So Giga Trait should stay put, at least for now. I mean, you destroyed them all. I was all back to Lydia most at once. Perhaps I have new strength to share. Maybe. Have you deliberately made this shield into the sledding variety somehow? Do you have to repolish it? Oh well. We got a few more weapons. Reduce damage from ice on a weapon for the Great Fairy. Z. And some lovely blue themed stuff. Another ethereal stone as well on top of that. One ruby too. I don't mind getting some rubies. That's all good for me. Seems like when I get a reduced thingy one, it's always ice at the moment. Wonder why that is. Not getting anything else, just ice. It's weird that it comes on the weapon as well. I guess it's the only place to really apply it. Usually something like that would be on a defensive piece of gear. So how many more trials do we have left to do? Chief in training is complete. That seems to be the desert for now. Yes, completing this one in Central Hyrule will be maxed out or gone up another level, which is probably exactly why you want me to do it. The Forest Dance Festival. You get five Gorok things, so I guess if it's a forest dance festival, the person we should take. Where's Hestu? <gasps> I can't take Hestu or Ibosa? Why won't you let me take Hestu? Restricted allies. Hestu does not want to dance? Why Hestu no want to dance? Your um, prince won't let you down. I mean, I could always take Sidon, right? Everyone loves Sidon. So we're gonna get the third tier of Central Hyrule done. Wall jumping. Yes, it's a bit weird that wall jumping. How can a sand still float? And also floats so well. Is, it, is the middle of a sand still just like, just like air? Just a pumped up rubber ball really is what a seal is. Like an owl, if you see it without its feathers, is the thinnest, tiniest twig you'll ever see. But with its feathers on, it looks a bit more of a bulky animal. It's a dance off with Hestu. What do you want me to do? Hey, buddy, time to cut loose and show the world your best moves. What? Her boast is part of it. This isn't a dance off, this is a battle. What? Hang on, this way. Did it. No. No. Hey. Hit with a big orca slap. Ready? Right, that's two dancers down. Very unfortunate for the poor Rido captain. We no longer can dance. I did. Hang on. Wump. It's a 
Shakalala, look at you. Yeah, I'm doing fine. I say, he looks like he's powering up. I think I've won, though. I am Bosa, you're our final dance battle companion. This way. Missed it. Hello, Bosa. Your side on is the greatest dancer now. Oh no, Hestu! <laughs> My final opponent is Hestu. Sorry, Hestu. Sidon is the greatest dancer. He came from the future to show you his special moves. Sidon wins the dance festival. You've heard it all proclaimed. Sidon is the greatest dancer. And he's got the most winning smile you'll ever see. Some new weapons, including another ceremonial trident. Most even got a weapon. Second prize. Five cork seats have been obtained. Sodom versus a Bosa doesn't seem very fair. What do you mean? Obviously, electric versus water in there good, but maybe you could think about it like, you know, a Bosa's got some incredibly dry skin from being in the desert. It's hard to moisturize. So when that skin gets moisturized by Sidon's moves, the, the cracking, like, like the moisture, it's just a bit too much and it stings. So, you know, extra damage. Maybe. Maybe. Is that how it works? Not enough aloe vera on the sun tent. Or sunburn. Hestu! Has another shakalabalakalakas! Weapon capacity plus three! Hestu is going to lead a parade in honor of Zelda and the champions. He wants to dress up courts for the musical spectacle and has asked you to find what he needs. I have it. Hestu's marched for some pep in everyone's step, and the courts and their costumes were delightful, so Hestu showed you his happy dance. Shaky shaka! Three more weapons. So that's just for Link, right? I mean, to be honest, we didn't need it. Central Hyrule. Done. 40 Hydro Melons. Use them a bit earlier. Let's go. Go in there with Link. No, no, no. Right, so we have.